just starting lurking on slash k slash really want to go in a woods recently got my fit sks for my birthday fuck yeah invite my only has guns friend along to go camping near appalachian trail he says yes brings a winchester lever action in 0.30 to 30. plan is to start up at northern part of massachusetts follow the trail south for three days we brought plenty of food and fuel not much water as we plan to be near rivers most of the time buddy brought a harmonica from now on i'll call him john we get dropped off near where we want to start and start hiking covering pretty decent ground for the first few hours slow down a bit after a quick lunch still moving along pretty well we stop for the night set up our tent i start the fire boil water we collected john cooks up some of our food plays harmonica a bit we're just sitting around the fire eating and talking bring up the fact that we haven't seen anyone all day he shrugs it off it's a bit shitty weather and cold so it's not that strange put out the fire and we go to bed sleeping with unloaded rafus we get up the next day strike camp eat cold breakfast and start hiking again suddenly we hear loud footsteps coming up the trail behind us running really fast we look behind us figure it's a trail runner or a dirt running from something ready rifles just in case the second we turn around the sound stops we're a little weirded out but continue along for a bit i realize that the woods are quiet as fuck ever since we heard the running mention it to john relax man it's almost winter most things are probably just hiding away in their burrows decide i'm just being a pussy ignore the silence we stop for lunch near a stream and john collects a bit of water from it sniffs at it to make sure it's semi-clean recoils what the fuck anon smell this water worry that he's gonna splash me in the face i take it and smell it oh god hiss is awful dot gif smells like rotten meat and piss we follow the stream up river to see if a dead dower or bear fell in and is rotting away in it after a few minutes of walking we come to a cave that the stream is flowing out of john walks in right away hey john wait a minute we shouldn't oh come on and on i've got a flashlight and i'm not gonna fall in so let's just check it out okay i guess grab my own flashlight and my sks following john into the cave we come to a huge ass cliff where the water falls down not really a waterfall but we it's smooth as hell made of this really shiny black rock all right john looks like we can't go any farther let's go back okay anon just let me look over here i thought i saw aha look at this man a staircase cut into the side of the cliff barely visible unless you look straight at it john immediately starts climbing up i follow him but i'm just about shitting my pants we're about halfway up when suddenly we hear this voice help me help me help me help me just repeating the same thing over and over in the exact same tone of voice exact same inflection it sounded like a broken record the voice was creepy as fuck it sounded like a human voice coming through a fucked up speaker crackly at the edges and sort of deeper than it should be obviously feminine it's coming from the top of the cliff john shouts up to it don't worry we're coming for you just hold on john wait a goddamned minute what the fuck anon are you just gonna walk away from somebody who might be stranded or hurt no but i don't think that then let's fucking go he double times it up the stairs rifle slung over his shoulder help me help me help me help me voice gradually getting louder and more distorted he's going a lot faster than i am that's what saves me he gets to the top of the stairs shines flashlight toward the sound ma'am are you suddenly stops talking i'm just a flight below the top i can hear him walking sounds really jerky but steady like a metronome or something steps suddenly stop at the exact same time the voice stops yelling for help i just barely hear john whisper of course whatever you need crunching noise sound of dripping liquid help me help me help me help me it's a different voice and it takes me a second to recognize it it's john's voice oh shit niggas dot mp3 fucking sprint out of there it's a miracle i didn't break my neck on those fucking steps manage to contact a friend who was going to pick us up in two days tell him something got john freaking out he calls the cops slash forest department tells me i have to meet them near a ranger station at a small town i managed to get out of the woods meet up with cops i claim a bear ate him 
lots of questioning, realize they think I might have murdered him, finally break down and tell this old grizzled ranger dude what really happened when we're alone. He just nods. There's some strange things what happened up in those mountains. Might be I'll head up there soon and take care of it. What the fuck? Is this guy serious? He smiles at me, and nods toward the wall of his office at the ranger station. A bunch of mounted skulls. They look like fucked up deer slash moose slash goat heads. Curvy horns, long jaw bones, huge ass eye sockets. Now, I'm off to go kill that bear of yours. I'll make sure them city boys know that you didn't do nothing. I'm sorry about that friend of yours. Good hunting. Thank ye kindly. I still can't get over it, especially since about two weeks after that, the paper printed a story about an individual who wished to remain nameless that had taken down a rabbit grizzly not too far off the Appalachian Trail.